All right, let's look for a one here, right? We want uh, a good, strong, fast opener, I think. Oh my God. Well, that's not good. That's not good. Are you Ben Bro's brother? No, I'm his dad. I'm his dad. Obvious, I mean, it's pretty obvious, right? Okay, let's hold this attack for the Jolly Roger, I guess. We're not gonna tidy up the body bagger anyway. We might be able to get two swings out of this if we're happy and lucky. Uh, does anyone know if Regis can play duels? Uh, we just did two duels runs, actually. You missed it. Are you the only one who doesn't see the game? Uh, so, to be clear, you see me, but not the game? <laughs> that does sound odd. <laughs> does Perjury Count has played other class cards? Yeah, if you play the cards you get from them, as you saw, we didn't actually get a class card here, unfortunately. Oh, perjury. Oh, wait, perjury, not parlay. Oh, perjury. Uh, no. Doesn't count as played. I, that's why I actually petitioned. I thought they really should have made perjury add a zero cost secret to your hand. Because it had way cooler synergies if you did. It had so many interesting synergies if you if you played it that way. Uh, mistake now? Yeah, sure, I guess. Let's get this hook tusk loaded up really quickly, right? This card makes hook tusk so easy to activate the Jolly Roger. If, if you if it had um, a zero cost, uh, this guy's cute. If it had a, uh, ooh, that's brutal. Dang, this card wins tempo so hard. If you got a zero cost secret in hand for, for perjury, it activates thief stuff, it activates zero cost things like miracle for rogue. There's just so many neat synergies that happen when you do it that way, as opposed to the alternative. It's really a shame we didn't get that. <sighs> yeah, because Agasan is four dragons, but Hook Tusk is eight pirates. That's an interesting, uh, that's an interesting point. Yeah, I hear you. I mean, could this card be six mana? I don't think anybody would really care, would they? I don't even think it'd be good at six, would it? I mean, maybe, maybe you made like a six, six or something, you know, to, to kind of balance it out a little, I guess, but I don't feel like we'd be oppressed with a six mana hook tusk by any means. Oh, dude, we're getting overwhelmed though. This is just so much stuff. Construct quarter strong. Have it start at 12 and lower for each pirate summoned. Oh, it's kind of a different angle, I guess. Yeah, there's probably way too much text for that. I kind of understand why they aren't able to fit all that in, but I like that mechanically speaking. So it becomes cheaper as you as you make stuff. Yeah, true. Bran would make that pretty gross, yeah. Uh, how do I think Hearthstone and Marvel Snap numbers compare in terms of active player base? Boy, that's an impossible question to answer, really. I uh i don't think we have any any real data insights there i i mean my instinct actually tells me that snap's a little higher at the moment uh because it's had like so many downloads in such a rapid fashion whereas with um with hearthstone you know it's had more total downloads of course right but they they definitely fall off faster over time Okay, I mean, we're hanging out here. We don't Finley with this hand. This is two really good cards in a row, right? Um, this is an insane card. <laughs> Dude, oh, like seriously, Leviathan's nuts. That makes Tess absolutely bonkers. So yeah, I don't, I, you know, hard, hard to know for sure, but, but Snaps had like 20 million downloads already, I think, in just a you know, few months, basically. I think I think it's twenty. I, I think I saw ten million on on Apple, and and they're usually matched with Android more or less. So probably probably ten twenty million downloads. I don't know. Dude, Okani murders me, dude. Murders me here. Oh, Okani's so good, <laughs> dude. If I lose the Leviathan, I will actually cry. Am I ever just better off passing this turn? Or, or maybe I just Sir Finley and assume it's not a spell, right? Like, they always pick minion, don't they? Maybe they don't pick minion because they think I'm running, like, all tiny minions? Oh my god, what do you guys think, chat? Is it minion or spell? 
They always pick minion. All right, Snug Boo, this is on you, man. I don't want this to go through, so hopefully Okani can cancels it. Oh my God. Dude, Snug Boo. You're done, Snug Boo. Get, get out of here. You're done. You're done, Snug Boo. You're dead to me. Everybody thought minion, by the way. Literally all of you thought minion. I agree with you too. Really, really unfortunate. Really unfortunate. If I shout us at Finley, I don't I don't get three threes, right? Do I value the three threes more? I think so. It's arguable, like if you want try to if you want to try to get your hook tuck hook toss back, right? It's I get it, it's arguable. Uh Horderon, dude, thanks to the prime sub. Yeah, I don't know why they'd ever pick spell. Not this again, no. We can just kill this one, so hopefully not too big of an issue here. I think is a little weird, right? Like Zola's and, and Okani's and stuff. I, I don't know what the, I don't know what their deal is. I don't know what this is, right? I'm not sure what this is. Uh, I don't know, man. I'm tired of dealing with your crap, Okani. Noxious Cadaver does. Oh God, that's fine. I didn't actually mean to click that, but it's all good. We're kind of dying, but oh, parlay again. Oh, interesting. Okay, Humaturge. All right, I like that. Favorite hand or fa favorite change after the mini set? Oh, I don't know, man. I uh, honestly haven't played enough yet. I liked that Pure Paladin we played a lot. Goldwing was cool. Uh, Purator was cool. Yeah, it could be Rainbow. I haven't really looked at Rainbow lists much. It showed up for like three days and then everybody started playing Frost immediately. So I never really had a good chance to assess what Rainbow was all about. Well, we are getting this board back though, which is cool. Ashbringer? Kind of like mana flexibility more, I think. Got weird math here for the Lobotomizer though. We want Pirate or do we actually want Undead? I, I don't know. Oh, Filet Fighter? A little more interesting math wise for the lobotomizer. Cutlass just draws me cards though, which is kind of the same difference. I got like that more. So we're gonna miss the, the lobotomizer hit here, but draw a card anyway is fine. Hinch clan, okay. So we've really won the board. 14 health. Heart strike is just a card. I don't know. Hey, hearth, 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 mash, hearth, smash. That's hard to say. Thanks the prime sub, dude. Welcome, welcome. Yeah, we do have corpses. Yeah. Death strike. Okay, we're really gonna need our hook tusk back, right? Oh, this is a dredge, though. Actually, oh boy. Um, do we do that this turn? No, let's get some lobotomizer value first. It's okay. No real urgency there yet. Oh, dang, that's cool. I mean, we can still play the swordfish, I guess. All right, no, no, no reason not to, I suppose. Flash of light, actually pretty legit, I think. Uh, let's, uh, we're gonna hook Tusk. She's at the bottom, right? So uh, we can draw her now. It doesn't really matter on order too much. Oh, she's not at the bottom. Oh, Tess? I mean, Tess is pretty nuts, right? No pirates, unfortunately, but we don't care enough about the vessel, do we? It does draw me another card, which is nice. Leviathan also draws me a card, which is nice. Oh, and it's more dredge. Yeah, no, that's better. Cause we can get Tess off the Leviathan. Yeah, that's definitely the pick. That's really good. Another round of dredge potentially is really nice. Okay, so that should put Hook Tusk cause there was only four cards in hand, right? I think when we fin lead or something. Tess, I thought Tess was, I, I thought Hook Tusk was on the left so she would be at the bottom. Does Finley do right to left? I thought for sure must do must do it. Uh... I mean, the vessel went in after, but Leviathan was on the right side of the hand, as I recall. Oh, cool, man. That's great. Thank you. Thank you for that. Great. Oh, uh, saved. <laughs> Actually saved, maybe. Uh, OK. Am I crazy? Did he just eat the hook tusk? No. Why isn't hook tusk on the bottom? I guess I'm crazy, man. I don't know. 
I think Tess is certainly more value than Vessel because there's like some card draw and stuff in there, right? I thought for sure we had the... Uh, I don't know, man. I thought it was in there. I, I don't know. I'm... I don't know. I just thought we had... I thought Hook Tusk was, was the leftmost card. And I thought it went left to right. But I guess it went the other way. Uh, Parlay doesn't shuffle the deck at all because we, we, it's not... It's not our deck. It's the opponent's deck. I don't think it shuffles anyway, but it's not even our deck that it's manipulating, so... Uh, okay. I mean, Tess is hopefully going to help me find some value. I mean, she's not even that much. We got, like, Hematurges, which don't give me anything. Um, Heart Strike could be good or bad. We had the card draw Paladin card. Um, was there anything else we even really had? Oh, did he? Oh, if he parlayed... Oh, it, does, it doesn't... It just swaps. They both stay in place, I think. It doesn't shuffle. Everything else was where it was supposed to be. Oh, did he take a Hook Tusk with a parlay? Maybe that's what happened to it. I don't guess I really remember that happening or thinking about it. Maybe that's where it went. You have no idea what I'm capable of. Yeah, I'm losing my mind otherwise. I, I still don't know the answer. Hit that. I need a hook tusk actually. No, I can't do this. He took a hinge clan burglar? I don't know. He got pushed to the fifth slot. I I, I guess Finley goes right to left then is, is the argument we're making. I, I don't honestly remember how Finley works. Not gonna pretend to know that. Burglar this time. Literate's fine. Sylvanas almost active. We need a hit on this Sylvanas, really. Kill this guy. That's cool. Shadow step. <sighs> Maybe I take some undeads because I just don't want to wait a whole turn to get some value off of this. I mean, there are some good undeads, but there are a lot of bad ones, too. That's a pretty good one, actually. Okay. Yeah, we probably take that, don't we? Which means no shadow step right now, but that's okay. Can I win this game long? I mean, <laughs> we've been playing this for a hundred years. I don't know, man. I don't know. I don't know if we can win this. Uh, there's, you know, endless health and value, but but Hook Toss can equalize fatigue, even though they were a Renathal deck, right? Um, wow. Wait, no, that's my Leviathan. It says created by Swashbuckler, but that's... No, he destroyed mine with... With, 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 no, he destroyed mine with patchwork, right? That's off his swash burglar? We both got. Okay, come on. No. I will Nonsense. <laughs> I refuse to believe it. I don't buy it for a second. All right, this dredges me the hook tusk, we think, still. There she is. There's our beautiful hook tusk. Okay. That's the one, finally. Do we shadow step uh, Leviathan here or do we actually shadow step Sylvanas? What do you guys think? Or neither, perhaps, is another alternative. We could also shadow step neither of them. Shadow step Hook Tusk is pretty insane, so I think we just save it. Right? Feels like a save. To me. Let's just shadow step. Oh my god! Ah. Uh, what? <laughs> Shadow Set Mograine could be another win condition, but I can't give them the Mograine, right? I, I'll die. I can't. Because I'm too low. I think we just take the Reno because it's more valuable to us than them, right? I gotta hope that Mograine's near the bottom of their deck, though. Otherwise, we're in trouble. Because that'll whittle me down. I mean, I guess with Reno, it's less trouble, to be fair, but... Still really nervous. Do I need to play... Well, actually, if we Hook Tusk, we can take that Mograine, can't we? Oh my god, dude. Hook Tusk into their Mograine, dude. That's the play, right? That's the play. Take five cards from deck, Shadow Step this. Take five cards from deck, Shadow Step this. Ah, oh, no Mograine, but Rivendare! Oh, that's crazy. Okay, that's a wing condition gone. Uh, the Reno is not active because of Parlay, is that right? Hopefully I don't die at eight here, dude. This game just got really fun. I'm gonna be super sad if I die here. We need to read but I, was he yellow or not? I didn't notice. It really does matter though. Don't be a Mograine, don't be a Mograine. Let me take the Mograine. 
I guess I take it now, even if, like, I'm gonna burn cards, but I just want to make sure I get as many as possible, right? For fatigue's sake. I can actually use that to clean up the Renathal. Oh, there's the parlay! Do I Reno this turn or next turn? Do I Reno this turn or next turn? This turn, you think? I mean, I'm not dead. Everybody says now, don't be greedy. What's gonna kill me though? What, like what's actually gonna, I guess, you know, it could kill me maybe is, uh, well, hero power plus no muncher doesn't. They already played a no muncher though. I wonder. We can do this together, right? And not take damage on board. And it would just be the one we think. He's only three short. No, we're gonna kill this if we play hook tusk, right? Certainly. Let's do it now. You guys, are, you guys are saying be safe. I'm cool with that logic. Uh, theoretically, they could get the bow green, but it's less of a threat now, right? Now we just win in fatigue, maybe. So, I'm cool with this logic. There's a chance we get our parlay back and take the final card as well. So, Th this is fine. This is definitely a lower risk, safer kind of play. I'm fine with it. Sylvanas into Reno's fine. It's no big deal. So this is Hook Tusk again. And we take the final cards. Parlay again, too. We don't get parlay. We know the final cards parlay. Uh, I have... I need to make a little space, I guess, huh? Did that just this is fine, I guess. <laughs> we want that Mograine probably, but whatever's fine, really. This stage. My resources dwindle. My resources dwindle! So their final cards oh it's all parlays <laughs> wait 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 a minute no wait a minute that is not what i thought was gonna happen it's just all parlays that's funny <laughs> it's just a bunch of parlays um okay <laughs> all right so i think we're pretty safe oh my god no way they have another one but i can just parlay after i kill that right and we can also just brand Mutanus here as well. Right, brand Mutanus. Eats that, that, that Astalor. That means I'm not parlaying one of the Rivendares now, but I can get one, right? Am I ever just happy? Well, I think we want to eat the, I think we want to eat the Astalor because that could be a real win condition, right? That could screw us. And then we got time on the, the, the Rivendares because we only need to get one of them basically. So we should be fine. This is okay. Who knows what secrets will uncover? Just eat that and we're, I think we're really happy, right? Yeah, there we go. Okay. That's, that removes a real lethal threat kind of card. Thanks for the oh, the re another Reno. I guess I didn't know that was coming. Let's, uh, let's let him trade that off. So we're more likely to have time to get it off the parlay, right? We can actually take two of those. Just for like ultimate safety, maybe. Um, also, he's just really out of cards right now. It's important as well. Three cards remaining. I can even Theatar as well. So we just hit this and then parlay both of these, I guess, right? And then he's just absolutely dead. What about the third one? It won't matter because the other ones won't have died, right? Oh, yeah, yeah. I, I forgot he had the Reno from our card. Yeah. Taunt, that's cool. Rush, that's cool. Uh, I guess there's Mograine here right now. We're, we're safe. Should be fine. He's down to two parlays. He's got the Lifesteal Rider. And now he's taking three per turn. Some cards of mine. Yeah, that's fine off those. Nothing in my deck that beats me, I don't think. Hashara could shuffle some cards into the deck, actually. That gives him a little bit more fatigue depth, I suppose. Yeah, there you go. Any crazy wind conditions off that, I wonder? I can actually start going for my own Rivendare. I probably don't really need to, but, but technically we can. Just all parlays, man. The parlays are more helpful for him at this stage than me, actually, because eventually he's going to run out of cards, right? Well, he's got some real cards now, though. Dude, this game is still a little wacky, honestly. This game is not actually solved yet, is it? 
Um, but all the all the cards he's getting off me are pretty garbage, right? Is this game indicative of the meta? No, this is one of the coolest games I've ever played and has no no indication of what real Hearthstone is like at all. I'm so sorry. I wish, dude, I wish. That would be incredible, but it's it's sadly nothing like the real meta. Oh, that's kind of nice. Have I really played that many holy spells this game? I mean, at this stage, I'm just kind of going for, for damage, I think, right? This thing's healing two per turn, but hitting for 13 per turn, so. Uh, with with the Mograin hitting for another three, right? We're, we're putting in quite a bit of heat here. Um, What did they take from me? What's left? Like a South Sea Scoundrel, a Jolly Roger garbage. Nothing good, right? Field of Strife's a bit of a whiff, I think. Sunken Vessels are fine. Killing my guy. Trying to kill my guy, freezing trap. Yeah, sorry, bro. He can replay it, right? It's only... Oh, maybe not. How much do they cost? Three, I guess. Yeah, that's lethal. Cool, dude. What a crazy fun game. Oh, my God. <laughs> dude, the hook tusk outvaluing the blood death knight. That is such a sick game.